All right, so before we get on the road, we decided to meet up with our other brother who's in Philly, but actually lives in South Carolina. So. Weekend apart, um, Leon's on his holiday, and I am with Noel. Um, I don't really have a lot of fun stuff planned. I gotta really get it together because uh, if I don't have anything planned, this might be even longer weekend than I want it to be. So currently, she's at camp till one. So this is my four hours to be alone. I am um, currently in the car about to eat McDonald's for breakfast because I love their hotcakes. And then I am going into Home Goods to look around for some stuff for the our new our bedroom and the new bathroom. Um, and then I think I'm going to go home and just kind of like be alone at home for the little bit of time that I can before I pick her up. And then I probably should go to the museum with her because they reopened and she hasn't been since. And that way it's supposed to be rainy, so it'll be something rainy that we can do inside that since it's gonna be rainy outside. So yeah, um, stay tuned. All right, I'm back from Home Goods. Gonna show you guys what I got. Um, I wanna try out this organizer for our utensils. I actually, <laughs> I actually went in there with intentions on finding plant stands and a big full length mirror for my bedroom. I didn't get either one of those, but that's okay. Cause I can always go back. And then I wanted a cute board. I'm gonna make me and Noe a little like charcuterie board for our little weekend together. So I wanted something that wasn't super expensive in case I didn't love it in terms of like matching our decor. I'm not really great at that yet. So this is only eight bucks. I'm gonna make us some little sandwiches. I got um, some m and some grapes. I'm gonna do some sandwiches. And yeah, hopefully just like have some fun hanging out with her. Um, I was supposed to be giving myself a pedicure while I was home alone, that didn't happen yet. But I got me a new nail polish. I'm not quite on board yet with the rest of the world with the white toes. So I'm gonna go with that color. Maybe I'll get there for summer's over. And then of course on my way out, I ran across these a room spray and this one's called de-stress so I'm going to try this just to like spray the house and see if that helps us feel good nothing else it smells good and then I found these really cute lamps for our bedroom I like saw it and I was like "Ooh, you might have to see it all together for it to like make sense but even if it doesn't it's my room so it doesn't really matter I'm sleeping in there not you guys so i got two of those leon approved because i for sure was in line waiting for him to respond i was like we about to have these lamps without him responding to me and then i got this really cute basket i was like this is such a nice big basket for 18 bucks so i'm going to use this in the living room for like a catch-all just to kind of keep it looking a little bit more like put together in the midst of not being put together um just to like throw the little stuff in so 
I'm leaving the tags on everything until I decide for sure what I'm keeping and what I'm not keeping. That is the lesson that I have learned from my mom and my friends who are like uh, much more bigger shoppers than I am. So they're like, you see it, you buy it, get home, decide if you want it. If not, you take it back as opposed to wishing you got it and then getting home and it's gone because apparently stuff flies off the shelf in these type of stores so um yeah so now i'm going to uh watch working moms if you don't watch it it is a really funny cute show that you don't really have to like super keep up with but like it's a nice little mom break so i'm going to do that for a little bit and then pick up the kid actually there was like a um the tractor trailer that was on fire as I was coming off of 95 to come home in the opposite direction. So I have to decide, I have to figure out and decide if it's safe for me to take her to the Children's Museum. Cause I'm not sure if I need to like go that way to get there or I think I have to go that way to get there. And so traffic's back up. So don't know what the plan is. We shall see. Bye. All right, so it's like 2.30 now. We are in Virginia. Oh no, we in North Carolina. We deep, like not deep. We like uh, near Raleigh, North Carolina. We about to switch. Uh, we got about like five hours left. I think I'm gonna take it us, take us in. Um, the rain, the rain getting in the way, man. We would probably made a little better time if it wasn't raining. But we about to uh, take this little rest stop. He stretch his legs. I do whatever. Handicap people do, and uh, be right back. There's blessings in having bigger brothers. Um, I got carried this whole ride. Uh, he did most of the driving. Let me try to fix it on the way back. But it's about six thirty, and we in South Carolina. Yeah. Pretty, pretty uh. Pretty stoked to see what was out here. Meet some of the Gucci people, you know. Oh, alrighty, we done made it down here with the Gullah Gucci and all that. Um, we did it in like what ten hours and twenty some odd minutes. Would have been a little faster, you know, had not the uh, handicap issues, you know. But and we got stuck in rain. The rain was slowing us down. We was doing about forty, yeah, for a good little while. But we had we got turned around like eight times. We just turned the camera around. That's what he meant. I had to turn the camera around. That's that's what he meant. I don't drive at night, man. I'm not a, a I'm not an experienced driver as an old fifty year old. Okay, I haven't been driving that long. I've been driving for five years. I can't on five. Ashy five, but five. Nobody almost got hit. Nobody. We here. Somebody might get hit now. I'm about to drive with these controls. This man trying to learn how to be a handicapped person and drive controls. So now we're about to take a family member out to this. Two family members out. Oh shit. What you gonna see? Ain't no chance. Got a break? Yeah. Oh, I see it up there. Yeah. That guy stopped. Yeah. She stopped. She stopped for the ball. She went back and stopped. Then you get up there and ask. You make it back to the right here. Do you have a stop sign? Okay. Do you want to use the spin or not? Spin or not? Use the spin or not? Yes. That's why you had to spin or not. Oh, I don't even scan up your water. Cut the grass. Which one is good? Take the ball. Came off. Push down, push down, break, and then put it in park. I'm about to. Throw it in park. Come on, you gotta get some real stuff that don't break. All right, how you take it off? You gonna take it off now? No play. Yeah, I just wanna drive. <laughs> <laughs> I, I saw that I can do it. Yeah, you gotta loosen those ones down, the break one. Loosen it. Loosen the nuts. Pause. Oh. Hey, look at you causing all this problem. <laughs> This I'm one's screw, right? No, it's two. One on top, one on the bottom. Mm -hmm. 
And this what you be doing while you driving? When it fall off? Yeah. See? You crazy. That's why you wanna let everybody die. And you can't handle that compressor. Right? Yeah, that's too much. Now y'all can hold on. We made it to the museum. Huh? Where are you walking? She's excited. We made it. There you go. So, beautiful ironing board. This is called the Mobility Accessible Room. I feel like. Oh, and here we have the lovely bathroom. Provide a shower chair and some type of contraption for the toilet. I don't know what that is. in the bathtub. Day two, South Carolina. I must admit that the bathroom was actually very accessible. 
Um, I was able to take a shower. I was able to use the commode chair very, very easily with very little spasms. Um, today, I have no idea what we're doing. There are all kinds of bugs. Look at that bug, bro. What is that? Is that a crab? That's a, what is that? It is. That's a baby crab. Hold up. That right there is a crab. I, I don't know if you can see it, but it's a crab. Yeah, let's see if you can get the move. Crocky, matey. Oh! He's going to jump up on something. Yeah, he jumped. <laughs> yeah. That's a baby crab. That's what's up. So as I was saying, this is day two. I don't know what is in store for today. We don't know what we have in store today. I think we're going to do a barbecue with the family. Um, other than that, oh, I have to get a new tire because my tire is flat. Um, other than that, max and relax and cool and some shooting some b-ball outside of school. Look like something is missing back here, man. What could it be? Oh, oh. We are back in action. Currently about to explore this wetlands, take a little trail, and look at that, an accessible trail. Oh, we're about to get into this. Oh, that would be nice. Look at that bird flying. Let's go zoom all the way in. Look at him just chilling. We're about to go over there, I hope. The cranes, this is beautiful, bro. Going on this little loop, <laughs> loopy doo. Hoping I see an alligator in the water. No, nowhere closer. That's nice. Yeah. Wow. Mother nature, beautiful thing. Okay. God's creation, it's a beautiful thing. <sighs> He a little too close to me to see that little buddy right there. That's 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 shouting distance, buddy. Look at that man, gator, successful gator watcher. Out here in the woods, the swamp lands, they call it the wetlands, Cypress wetlands. All right, we're at one of my favorite restaurants for lunch. Yesterday was Saturday. Is your favorite? Yeah. Yesterday was Saturday. We didn't leave the house. My best friend came over, and so we hung out, and it was marvelous. So now we are headed to Friendly's to have some lunch. I'm gonna pretend to get something because she knows I'm not getting none of that machine. North. We are at the North Carolina Welcome Center. Um, headed home. Um, it was about a 10 hour ride when we left. We got about another seven and a half left to go. Probably won't be pulling into my house till about three in the morning. Um, so far, it's a great ride. Ride on 4th of July is pretty good. I'm loving it. It's chilling. Um, not too many people out, no cops out. 
we grooving. We was going to stop at south of the border. My thumb in the way. We was going to stop at south of the border, but uh, no, nah, that joint looked trash. So we uh, we just did a rest stop real quick. I'm about to get some sodas and see if I can pull another 200 miles out of it. Then switch it over to let him handle the rest. I'll probably do another 150. I did like 200 now. I did better this time going back than coming and coming. I was trash. Nighttime driving and wet driving ain't for me. But daytime, oh, I'm good. I got you. I can get you when you need to go in the daytime. Nighttime, I'm blind. some food away that we brought home and then I'm crashing hard. This was fun. Oh, I enjoyed it. Anyway, I'm going. You know. 